Welcome to this, the second video in the Ranarek Studio Release 9.1 Improvement Series. Improved Start and Close AUT Actions. The Improved Start and Close AUT Actions increase the stability of your tests and ensure that the correct application and only the correct application under test is opened and closed. It does this through the use of parameters. Parameters are an advanced topic and knowledge of them is in no way necessary for you to use the solution wizard. They simply improve the test stability. However, this video offers a basic understanding of what is happening behind the scenes. To begin, we ensure that the demo app is open and start Renorex Studio 9.1. Then select new solution via wizard, desktop, and then name your solution. Choose the demo app, or whichever app you wish to test, and we will focus on a single application. Finally, we click finish. Your test suite appears. You will notice that the start AUT and close AUT each have a bound variable associated with them. An app process ID linked to both the start and close AUT process ID variable. Put simply, this parameter acts as a bridge between the setup and teardown regions, along which information can be passed. In this case, the specific application under test, meaning that Ranarex opens and closes the exact same application instance. You are also able to close the AUT by other means, by killing the process or closing the window. Closing the window will require the action to be linked to a repository item. If we run the recording, we see that Studio has opened and closed one instance of the demo app. As has already been mentioned, the start and close AUT actions simply improve testability and a knowledge of parameters is not needed for it to function. Parameters and variables are, however, incredibly useful and offer lots of opportunities in data-driven testing. Full details of data-driven testing can be found in the user guide, a link to which can be found in this video's description. This is the final video in the release 9.1 series.